my family, Prince Harry and Meghan, the Duke and the Duchess of Sussex are in San Diego. Whereby my family, Harry and Meghan, joined the Navy SEAL Foundation for the opening of a training facility for veterans in downtown San Diego. My family, I am in awe of everything that Harry and Meghan do for veterans. And my family, right now, they are touching the lives of veterans in the United States of America. My family, you know? And the Invictus Games, my family, founded by Harry, is touching the lives of veterans, my family, from all across the world. That is what they're able to do, my family. And my family, I love what Harry and Meghan are doing and what they're continuing to be able to achieve, touching the lives of veterans from all across the globe, my family. And every single day, I hope that Britain realizes just what they lost. Instead of cherishing what they had, Harry and Meghan, my family, they chose to be racist towards the woman that Harry loves. That is what they chose to do. And now Harry and Meghan have fled Britain. Now they are touching the lives of veterans in America. My family. And this is quite remarkable and just amazing. Quite remarkable and just amazing. You know, my family, ever since Prince Harry founded the In Victors Games, my family, you've seen just how many veterans are in awe of Prince Harry, of what he's been able to do for them, on the lives that Harry has been able to touch, thanks to founding the In Victors Games. And now my family, whether it's the Stand Up For Heroes, you know, event, benefit event in New York, Harry is invited to do a stand-up act because everyone can see what Harry has done to benefit veterans. And that's why my family, Harry, is invited to these kinds of events. My family, because of what he's been able to do, the lives that he has been able to touch and continues to touch. My family, Harry truly is an amazing guy. And so is Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex. My family. You know, I remember what Meghan was told by, you know, a team, an Invictus Games team, while my family in Dusseldorf. My family. Meghan was told by an Invictus Games participants who said, you, you, meaning Megan, keep supporting him. That is what Megan was told to do. You keep supporting him, my family. And I'm so happy to see that, you know, Megan is fully, fully supporting the love of her life. Her husband, you know, Prince Harry. My family, I mean, just look at that moment, my family. At the Invictus Games in to sort of my family. My family, and you, thank you for supporting him, and you, thank you for supporting him. My family, Prince Harry has always wanted that special person, a partner, to basically support each other, to be with him during these important events. And my family, I'm sure he's also happy to have Meghan by his side fully supporting him. Harry, you truly are very much a blessed man. And Harry, may you always know just how much you are loved, admired, and very much respected. You and Meghan, the Duke and Duchess 
of Sussex. And my family, also Prince Harry and Meghan, along with the Navy SEAL Foundation leaders, veterans, and their families, officially opened the Warrior Fitness Program West Coast facility with a ribbon cutting ceremony on Wednesday evening. And my family, this ceremony was also attended by up to 250 my family this ceremony was also attended by up to 250 naval special warfare personnel and their families wow my family i like that 100% the ceremony was also attended by up to 250 250 Naval Special Warfare Personnel and their families. And the facility features state-of-the-art fitness and workout resources, rehabilitation technology, and advanced biometric tracking systems. And the new space boasts an 11,169 square foot gym with more than 8,000 square feet of quiet and specialty spaces in its upstairs areas. And the Warrior Fitness Program aims to optimize human performance for warriors on the battlefield. My family, who are transitioning into civilian life or retired from service, the Navy SEAL Foundation said, my family, the Navy SEAL Foundation said, and my family, the Navy SEAL Foundation said, the brand new facility will help active duty and veteran naval special warfare personnel heal physically and mentally from combat. You know, my family, and this is exactly what Harry has always said, you know, be used of sports to help veterans be able to heal my family you know to be able to heal from the wounds of war both psychologically and also you know my family physically and also physically both physically and also mentally my family i'm happy what Prince Harry has been able to achieve. I mean, my family, the lives that Harry has been able to touch. Wow. Wow. Just amazing. Just amazing. The lives that Harry has been able to touch. My family, it is quite, quite very much remarkable. You know? And I'm so happy to see that Harry and Meghan are being invited to these special, remarkable events. My family, as I've always said, really, is that also the fact that Harry and Meghan are being invited by amazing foundation, my family, by amazing people, it shows just how much this smear campaign continues to fail. You know? It shows just how much this smear campaign by William, Kate, Charles, and Camilla against Harry and Meghan, why it keeps on failing. Because Harry and Meghan are blessed, they are loved. And my family, no one believes the lies being spread about Harry and Meghan by the racist UK tabloid press. Everyone who uses their own basic common sense can see what Harry and Meghan have been through. And my family, they support Harry and Meghan. And they are in awe of what Harry and Meghan are able to do for veterans, how they bring a smile to the faces of veterans. My family, Harry and Meghan, are so loved. And I hope. They always know just how much they are loved, admired, and so, so respected. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Harry and Meghan, for everything you do for veterans from all across the world. Be it through the Invictus Games or be it through your partnership or work with the Navy SEAL Foundation. Thank you, Harry and Meghan. Thank you so, so much. My family... Prince Harry has supported even various U.S. veterans' foundations since moving to California. And my family, it is not 
Harry's first visit to San Diego. In June, Prince Harry attended the Department of Defense annual water games at Naval Station, North Island. Prince Harry also made another surprise appearance at a Chula Vista movie theater in August, whereby moviegoers were astonished when Prince Harry spoke to attendees and posed for selfies before screening of his Netflix docuseries, Heart of Invictus. My family, wow. We are in awe of everything that Harry and Meghan are doing to make this world a better place. The lives they're able to touch. My family, wow. Wow, 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 wow. You know, I feel like, thank you even, is it enough to say how deeply grateful we're able to see what Harry and Meghan are doing for others. They are doing so much. And may they keep on being blessed for the lives they're touching, for everything they do to make this world a better place for family, for the lives of veterans and their families. My family, they are touching through their work, through their actual foundation, my family. You know? And also... Speaking of the actual foundation, on Harry and Meghan's foundation, actual. My family, here's what they said in the actual foundation. My family, allow me to kindly read you this. Prince Harry and Meghan, the Duke and the Duchess of Sussex spent the morning also with veteran and active duty service members and their loved ones at Camp Pendleton in San Diego, California. My family, Harry and Meghan spent the night in California. That is very clear. And I'm hoping that, you know, first of all, they had the best fun ever, you know, in San Diego. My family, here is what was also said. But... Of Harry and Meghan's visit included time spent with Operation Biggs, a first of its kind mentoring program for children of military families, including active duty veteran and gold star families. Mentors and mentees shared how mentorship is supporting their goals and ambitions, as well as the benefits of the community they are built through Operation Biggs. Founded in the year 2004, the program connects young people and families to mentors who can relate to the shared experiences and challenges faced by having a parent or parents in the military when they are on deployment and after they have returned. Wow. This is, you know, life changing my family. You know, and to date, the program has served more than 3,000 Navy and Marine Corps children and has expanded to over 30 affiliates across the country. My family, that is the message. My family that was basically, you know, posted on Harry Meghan's actual foundation website my family accompanied by pictures by pictures of harry megan you know my family at camp pendleton in san diego california and my family wow first of all i love this picture of you know megan basically you know holding a phone while prince harry looks at the phone wow wow Wow, my family. Wow, I am in love. I feel like I want to fall in love, you know, once again, my family. Just looking at this picture. Wow, these two are in love. I mean, this picture. Wow. I love it so much. I love it so much. Whoever took this picture, my family, you know, wow, this is beautiful. This is gorgeous. The photo that they were able to take of Harry Meghan is just, it's magical. It is magical, my family. I just love seeing that glow from both Harry Meghan. I love seeing that glow from both Harry and Meghan, that smile 
in both Harry and Meghan's you know, faces. It's just beautiful to see Harry and Meghan smiling. My family, it's quite a joy to watch Harry and Meghan smiling you know, together as a couple. And my family, clearly, they had a very, very good time. They had a very, very good time. You know, you know, in the Harry and Meghan documentary, I believe we saw, you know, Meghan and Harry going to a military base, you know, at the time, my family, as, you know, I believe for those who've watched the Harry and Meghan documentary will understand what I am saying, my family. And there is something that Meghan even said, my family, that when Harry, you know, comes to a base, a military base, you can see him switch, you know, to military banter. Clearly, he feels happy to be inside a military base. And also, kindly, don't forget that Prince Harry, once upon a time, he did say that, you know what, you know, and I quote, he generally does not like to be in England because of what? Because of the UK terrible press and the nonsense they write. And he's happy to be my family in Afghanistan, serving his country, fighting for his country. You know, that's what Harry was happy doing my family. The guy would much rather be in a war zone rather than basically be anywhere near the UK tablet press. Yet every single day, you see how carnival or so-called experts keep demanding or somehow, you know, hoping, you know what? Harry is going to come back with a tail between his legs. Harry is going to rejoin the row fold. And my family, that would mean that Harry has to work with the same, same UK media that have put him and Megan through hell. My family, that is never going to happen. That is never, ever going to happen. That is never going to happen. Harry and Meghan will keep protecting their peace and protecting their mental health. Harry and Meghan will keep loving each other. Harry and Meghan will keep choosing each other and choosing to protect their mental health and protect their kids from the toxic UK media. My family. And they'll keep serving, helping out others, helping out veterans my family. And guess what? They'll accomplish so, so much outside of the toxic institution. They'll keep accomplishing so much outside of the toxic institution of Britain, that is the British monarchy. My family. And William and Charles will see their worst nightmare realized. That they will keep being exposed for being the ones who signed off on a press assault of Harry Meghan, or for, on the hounding of Harry Meghan. Charles and William and Kate and Camilla will keep on being exposed, while Harry Meghan will keep on thriving, will keep on being loved, my family, because they are full of so much compassion, an amazing, amazing heart, my family. Harry Meghan are good kind-hearted, amazing human beings. And may they know just how much they are so, so loved, my family. You know, my family, I love this photo of Harry and Meghan, you know, basically Meghan holding a phone and Harry is just, you know, sitting down and looking at the phone and Meghan looking at another, you know, direction, my family, speaking to someone, you know, perhaps. My family, it's a gorgeous photo. It's a gorgeous and beautiful photo, my family. You know, wow, 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 wow. This is quite magical and i'm sure the prince harry appreciates and is so happy to have megan by his side supporting him during this important you know events going to military bases my family to support veterans i am sure that harry is so happy to have megan by his side to have the mother of his children by his side my family you know and i'm sure that megan also is happy supporting her amazing, remarkable husband, the father of her children, Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex, my family, you know? And my family, basically, clearly, Harry and Meghan are very happy. And for me, seeing them smiling, seeing them being happy, seeing them supporting each other, my family, for me, it's a joy to watch. 
I am happy to see Harry and Meghan supporting each other and just loving each other, my family. For me, I'm so happy. And may they keep on supporting each other, loving each other each and every single day of their lives, my family. My family, it's so amazing to wake up in the morning and the first thing you see is, you know, Prince Harry and Meghan once again touching the lives of veterans. The one thing you see is that my family, these gorgeous photos of Harry and Meghan, you know, supporting each other and supporting veterans, my family. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. And we keep on seeing more and more of this. My family, I believe I have said enough. Now you, tell me your thoughts about what we have just discussed. I want to kindly hear your opinion, family. God bless Harry, Megan, Archie, Lil Bedana and Doria Raglan, and all of you, members of the squad at home. He never wins, love wins, and stay tuned to our next video. My family, love you all and forever. And Harry Megan, thank you so, so much for everything you do to make this world a better place. Thank you. Thank you. Please keep on touching the lives of others. Please keep on putting a smile on the faces of others. Harry Megan, and may you keep on being blessed. Harry Megan. To you and Megan, to you, Harry and Megan, we wish you all peace, love, joy, happiness for the rest of your lives. Both you, Harry and Megan, and also your amazing children, Archie and Lil Bedana. And also, not to forget the amazing Mama Doria Ragland. My family, kindly stay tuned to our next video. Love you, Oza forever, and may God bless you, all my family. May God bless you, all my family. Thank you, Harry Megan, and thank you to the Navy SEALs Foundation also for making all this possible for veterans, you know, for them to be able to heal and recover from the wounds of war. My family, stay tuned to our next video. Love you all and forever, and may God bless you all my family. Hello, members of the Zesco Family TV. First of all, I want to say thank you for all your support that you give us to our channel. We don't take it for granted that you support this channel. I want to say thank you from the bottom of our hearts for lending out your support and fighting against injustices, supporting Prince Harry and Meghan, showing them love. Love will always triumph over evil and for that I say thank you. Good will always prevail over bad. Thank you so much for all your support. Thank you so much for joining this community, this amazing community of Zesco Family TV. I love you so much family from the bottom of my heart and I wish you all the best. May you have a great, great day. And I hope that you enjoyed this video and learned a lot, a lot of things. With that and so much more, stay tuned to our next video. Leave a comment below, like and subscribe. Love you family, always and forever. Sayonara.